Whether you believe in fate or not, you cannot deny that sometimes everything just lines up perfectly, better than you could have imagined. I'm like already wanting to cry, I haven't even read it yet. I am so happy to be marrying you today. I think back to when we first met in Croatia, and look where we are now. I've never made a better decision in my life than agreeing to go on that trip. You have made me so incredibly happy these past few years, and I can't even begin to express how excited and thankful I am to call you my husband. You are everything to me, and you will be for as long as I live. Sorry. <laughs> I am confident that you will be a great wife to me and a wonderful mother to our children. There are so many unknowns in the years and decades ahead of us, but how reassuring it is knowing that you'll be with me. Today is the most important and happiest day of my life. <laughs> but I know it will not be the happiest because I have a lifetime of memories to make with you. And it all starts today. Nicole and Dan have asked us all to be a part of this celebration of their love, and it is with great excitement that we do so. Their love and commitment to one another does not begin today, but has been ongoing since fate brought them together on a sailboat four years ago. Neither of them had a clue that the late addition of Nicole to a fun-filled summer vacation would change both of their lives in such a profound way. Nicole has found the perfect soulmate. Somehow, some way, they ended up getting placed on the same boat, on the same ocean, and everything just fell into place. A few years out of uh, college, we had uh, a great opportunity to take a trip that I think changed our lives, right? More so for, for you. I had a great time, but... <laughs> A couple of these guys, Tyler and Derek, we were talking about doing this trip in, in college. Some of Dan's friends and my mutual friends had planned a trip to Croatia for a yacht week. A girl ended up dropping out at the last minute so they needed to fill the spot and they asked me to go. Nicole, for some reason, when it was 90, 95 degrees outside on this trip every single day, she was downstairs boiling water, making pasta for us and cooking eggs and it had to be 120 degrees down there. And from the first few days of the trip, we saw something that was pretty great. Nicole would cook an amazing dinner for the, for the boat, right? And then right after dinner, we're like, where's Dan? Dan's cleaning. Dan's cleaning the dishes. I was like, yeah, I could probably just go do dishes. <laughs> That'd work, right? And so from the start, they were, they were in sync, which was pretty beautiful to watch, right? So Andrea may have seen something, I didn't. I really just thought that he was like having a good time washing the dishes because no one else was. <laughs> it took, it, it honestly took me like a month or two after the trip to realize that they had something together. So it was, they, they hit it pretty well. I remember about four years ago, Nicole went to Yacht Week and when she got back, I remember hearing about this really cute guy and he was great and they just really hit it off together. But much more importantly than a storybook meeting is the fact that I see how somehow they complete one another. Everyone's already talked about the famous sailing trip. Well, when Nicole got back and she was talking about the guy that she had met, you could tell it was something different. <laughs> Robin's for you. <laughs> 
<laughs> but you can use it. <laughs> it wasn't just, I've met this great new guy different. It was something special. I just want to say I'm super excited to be able to call Dan my brother in law. Here's to y'all. something about the other. Nicole was first attracted to Dan's kind heart. She envisions a life full of adventures and travel with her best friend and their five kids. <laughs> Surprise. Dan was first attracted to Nicole's smile, enthusiasm, and how she brightens every room she enters. When asked what makes him smile when thinking about marrying Nicole, he said, knowing that I will be able to say that my wife is the most incredible person I have ever met. I give you this ring to wear with love and joy. I give you this ring to wear with love and joy. As a ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. As my... <laughs> as, <laughs> as a ring has no end. As a ring has no end. Neither shall my love for you. Neither shall my love for you. I choose you to be my wife this day and forevermore. I choose you to be my wife this day and forevermore. I give you this ring to wear with love and joy. As a ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. As a ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. <laughs> Nailed it. I choose you to be my husband this day and forevermore. I choose you to be my husband this day and forevermore. I pronounce you husband and wife. You may now seal your commitment with a kiss. <laughs> You are simply meant to be together. You keep each other laughing and smiling as you move through life and it's contagious to those around you. I'm so happy for the both of you. You guys are so meant to be. You have so many of the same qualities and I really see how happy you are, Nicole, when you're with Dan. My hope for you too is that you travel the world together, take risks, live your dreams, and always appreciate the reasons you fell in love with one another. To Nicole and Dan, to a long, wonderful life. Hope all of you are enjoying this celebration with us. I know I am when I'm not crying. <laughs> if you've seen their pictures and all, you know they've been many places already. Of course, you've heard about the, the great selling trip in Croatia that I didn't know much about. <laughs> and their dating afterwards, I knew nothing about. <laughs> I've always told Nicole, you want someone that wants as good or better for you as they want for themselves. And I think she's found that in Dan.
I've seen Dan put her needs before his before, and the boy can wash some dishes. <laughs>